Hey guys, we're Time6, we're back with another reaction. Today we're doing an episode of Request. This is Monk, season one, episode one, called Mr. Monk and the Candidate, part one. If you enjoy our videos, make sure you leave a like, comment down below your thoughts, and remember to subscribe for future uploads. You can also check out our Patreon page, get early access and full reactions for all the shows and movies that we watch on the channel, along with request your own episode or movie for us to watch. Links will be down below. This was requested to us by RG on Patreon. Thank you for the request. And before we start, uh, I have no idea what this is. Have you guys heard of it? Nope. 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 I'm expecting martial arts. I'm expecting a temple. Maybe several. Okay. Potentially bald people. That's what Works. I ex was expecting because until I the saw the poster. The poster. <laughs> that did not look like anything. Yeah, that doesn't... <laughs> Not at all. But we'll see what it's about. Let's get started right away. Crime scene? Oh shit, crime scene. The stove. Over here. It's in the kitchen. No, I mean my stove. I, I think I left it on. Oh my god, this guy. He's tall. It's 6'3", uh, six, maybe 6'4". Six, what about the... What about the pile of light? Because, you know, Dude, drop the stove. Right. Well, I guarantee you he's right. So that's the famous Adrian Monk? Yeah, the living legend. Adrian Monk. Not bad. Just call that living. I mean, he got more Rude. information than you guys did. Yeah. He forgot. That's a re good reason. He's a finicky genius. In the plastic bag. I feel like I'm back in the saddle. One sock in each bag? I owe it all to you. What? Jesus. <laughs> Is a crime gonna happen? Uh, There's no joke. He is a hitman. Look at this guy. That's, dude. He knows. He knows. You people sound like you're ready for a change. Uh oh. An assassination. Oh, he missed. He missed. You suck. He hit her. He shot a security guard. Press here, who's here? Uh, the girl from Channel 3. Pretty one? Uh, no, the other one. <laughs> it's okay. It's Get okay. Who you want on camera? Miss. Mayor wants you to bring in your old friend. Oh? Monk? Monk? Why not? It's red! It's red! Come on! <laughs> that was red. Oh, that's the other one. When we get in there, you don't say anything. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. St. Clair, can you think of anybody who might wish you harm? A disgruntled employee? Somebody tried to kill oh, my no. husband yesterday, right in front of me. Is he screwing up the board? Excuse me. That's color coded by voting precinct. It took me three weeks to set this up. I'll put them all back the way they were. No, 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 stop. You can't possibly remember how everything was, so just. Yeah, oh. Yes, he can. Yes, yes he can. Take one second, Lee. I can just... do it. Adrian, let go of the board! He can you remember go. now? He let go. He probably can. So, Captain, you say he's no longer with the department? He was given a 315. Yo, look at this guy. Oh, he can. It's a form of anxiety disorder. A severe case like this is usually triggered by a single traumatic incident. Oh. There. <laughs> Sees it. He used a drawstring to steady his shot. I've seen it before in the field manual for the Green Berets, Special Forces. How tall are you? Six foot. No, really. Five below. <laughs> six three, maybe six four. Just oh. like Santa Clara. Oh, well, you think there's a connection because this guy might be tall? Do you know the percentage of men over six foot three? No, do you? Maybe zero point five. The really? Odds of two men in this city in that category committing premeditated murder within two days of each other are astronomical. My name's Adrian Monk. Here's my card. If you think of anything, you give me a call. Okay, sure. <laughs> no. <In the> hat. <laughs> Jason had passed. This guy is too good to be I true. Yes. I think he did it. Who? Sinclair. <gasps> what? 
What are you doing? Do you have what? my keys? I can't find my keys. I don't have keys. Why? Adrian, calm down. I don't have... I got it. Okay. I got it. You're such a relief, you know. This idiot. Oh! I didn't... <laughs> what the fuck? Bro. In a few seconds... We will be closing the cast. Oh, oh no! Oh, no! Jason. The keychain, it was Trudy's. I got oh, it. Oh, God. I have to go get it. Oh, Is God. he gonna try to. Wow. Here we go. This is oh, if their eyes are closed. Oh, 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 perfect. Oh, oh. <laughs> There's no way this is working. Come on. We turn and salute you one last time. Oh, no! He's gonna move and everyone's gonna freak out. Shit. Wait, did he get the A keys? miracle. A miracle. <laughs> he got him. I mean, he got him. awake at night thinking of ways to disrupt my husband's campaign. I'm told you're germaphobic, afraid of the dark, heights, crowds, and milk. They're working on the milk. milk? He's making good progress on why, it. Why milk? Huh. N Nicole Vasquez. Uh, no. Oh. oh! No. He did no a side eye. You should. We're gonna follow the money. Mm. Ugh, I've always wanted to say that. <laughs> <laughs> My queen calls, he sang out as he bowed. <coughs> Just oh, put on. a mask on. When shall I start? There's your mask. He rolled end over end. No. When he Don't do it. Don't! He's please. gonna eat it. <laughs> yeah. Our does anything. Do you have any bank accounts in your own name? No. No, he's running for mayor. I, I would think that would be kind of kind of stressful. <laughs> I knew that. Bro, there's chairs behind you. What are you? Yeah, get those proper ones. Last week, if I could have, I would have taken that bullet myself. My ass. You have to believe me. Liar. Nobby. I think I found something. I'll, I'll be right there. Uh, actually, I was about to leave. I, I could drop it off at your place. I'll be there in about a half hour. Good. I'll, I'll meet you there. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Thanks. No, not today. Come on. I just cleaned it. Come on. It's him. Oh. <laughs> so fucking GTA. <laughs> what the? <laughs> oh, shit. How did he find Who you? Who was chasing that call? Yeah. <laughs> Oh shit. Check his hat. What? Oh. He didn't say oh. things in his hat. It's a single car accident. No, no. No, this was no accident. There's no skid marks on the road. It's wet. <laughs> Please said that. Detective here, monk. I checked the skid marks. No, this was staged. He was killed somewhere else. We were meeting at my house. He probably took coal. I'm thinking he was killed at that stop sign on 17th Street. Why 17th? There's a homeless shelter there. They wash windshields for spare change. Okay. I'm thinking somebody approached the car. Okay, that's a strike. You can see the windshield even better from here. The driver's side's clean. No, the I see the side's yeah. filthy. Okay, okay, okay. Where are you going? I have a date. I told you about it. Uh, I thought you were joking. What? She's got her own life. You thought I was joking? It's chicken pot pie night. Don't be such a baby. My loving you okay could make a chicken pot pie. Oh, no. But then you said... Oh, the recipe? Two thirds of a cup. Two thirds? Oh, no, give me your phone. It, it's... Mike? It's 11 year old. Is that you? Okay, I'm hanging up now. Hey, don't call back. Benji's got homework. Lots of it. Don't hang up. No, not Benji. Call me back. <laughs> the peas. Why is he doing it one of the... Oh. He's... <laughs> Moderation and all things. Is he seeing something? Hmm? Is he having like a Except PTSD <laughs> episode? Of course. This guy sh oh my Well, uh, why don't you join us? No, he shouldn't, you know, he's coming. That guy is way too understanding. I'm don't like, fuck out of here. Yeah. <clears throat> I feel okay when you're around. Carl said that uh, he was talking about living in England. He was a Rhodes scholar. No, yeah? kidding. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he graduated magnum cum laude. Wow. Cum laude. Right. I know. I'm, I'm, I'm no good at this. Okay. This man is lying to you. <gasps> He's not a lawyer. What? 
Oxford doesn't have a magna cum laude. And you sue a newspaper for libel. That's slander. Oh. Whoa. That looks. What the hell is that? What the hell is that? Yes. Embellishes the resume. It's called human nature. Do you think I told him about Benji or about that summer he's been dancing in Atlantic City? No. What kind of dancing? <laughs> I can't do this anymore. Oh. I quit. Not again. No, no. I mean it this time. I'm sending my sister over for my stuff. Okay, well, you know you're just gonna come back. Whoa. Don't tell me what I'm gonna do. No. It's too late. Damn. I'll never forget you. You never forget anything. <laughs> oh! Damn. Oh! That guy sussed in the back of the jacket. Dude, this show put me in a mindset where I'm looking at everything. It's like, what, oh, is that sus? What city is this? Is that fire hydrant sus? It is. It's too rusty. Oh, he's still investigating his. Oh, it's unsolved. Mm. Hmm. It's the one case he can't solve. Where have I heard that before? <clears throat> oh, what? Okay. Oh, shit. Don't play the next one. Not yet. All right, guys. That was the reaction portion of the video. Make sure to stay tuned for the discussion. If there's any part of the episode that we weren't able to keep in our YouTube edit, click the link down below for the pull and cut reaction. And let's discuss now. Monk, Mr. Monk, and the candidate. So candidate meaning the election mayor yeah. dude with the super sussy wife. The sussy wife and the sussy son? And the sussy Goodman. And the Jesse. Is that son? No. No, it's a vice yeah, president vi yeah. of... Or vice campaign manager, something like that, yeah. He's the vice. Vice son. <laughs> he's the vice something. He's drinking with the wifey. And he's giving the wife the, wi the vice grip. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Oh, man. All right. Well, what, what are we thinking? Pilot episode. Even though it's a two-parter. Oh, it was a really good pilot. It definitely sets the tone for the show moving forward. What I like about this is it's not a complete comedy. No. So the comedy is spared. Like, it's used sparingly. Yeah. And it is a drama. Mm. And it's an actual, like, solving kind of show, you know? Which I like a lot. And not just that, the main character, Monk, they could have made him a badass, right? Just solving shit left and right. But they gave him this quality where he's super uh, anxious. Yeah. A little bit of OCD, germaphobe, right? Scared of heights. The whole nine yards. Yeah, it scared really balances it out milk. and makes... What? Scared of milk. Yeah. Curious about that story. Uh, maybe the way like it's like it comes out of the... It might be a germ thing. Anyways, yeah, so I like how they're setting up the character. Mm -hmm. It's super interesting. I mean, I gave. I, I feel like I was just talking. You yeah, just to add on one thing to what you you mentioned about how they're, they use the comedy sparingly. I actually think that it's a little bit more than sparingly. I feel like it's almost split, almost 50-50 between, like, you know, the lighthearted scenes. And mm -hmm. during these lighthearted scenes, there's, like, a upbeat, you know, the soundtrack, I don't know what instrument it is, but it, it's like a, almost like a bell system. It, they use it a lot in House. The music is very similar to House. Mm. Yeah. So that's what it threw In terms of the comedy, right I'm getting a Suits vibe, where Suits has a lot of comedy, but at the end of the day, it is a drama. And it's, the, the purpose of the show is not to make you laugh, it's no. to drive the story, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So like compare this to something like Brooklyn Nine-Nine. Mm -mm. The purpose of that show is to make you laugh. It's completely different. Yeah. But this show, they want to tell a story, which I like more. Mm -hmm. than this story is very interesting, too, yeah. with his wife, and he's still trying to solve Yeah, they're already setting shit up that can, like, yeah. just, you know? For sure. But I like how most of Monk's scenes are very lighthearted, because he's obviously a disturbed and traumatized man. So. He's disturbed, but he's still very innocent. Like Yeah, absolutely. In his heart, yeah. I think. Like, him dropping the keys, that's so fucked up, but... <laughs> He's going. Was, oh yeah. my god, that was <laughs> really good. 
Totally forgot about that. But yeah, he's processing his grief in a healthy manner, it would seem. Well, it's not just the processing, it's also the fact that he hasn't solved the case mm -hmm. of his wife, yeah, yeah, right? Yeah. No one has. So that added on to the grief that can create some shit, which we're seeing. Totally. So I really like it, but the way this thing abruptly ended, I think we shouldn't waste time in watching the next one. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. let's do it. All right guys, thanks for watching our reaction for Monk, season one, episode one. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you leave a like, comment down below your thoughts, and remember to subscribe for future uploads. And we'll see you in the next video. Peace.